the boyfriend of Annabelle Falkhold who died in the Boxing Day horror smash that killed her parents in New South Wales, Australia, has paid tribute to his beautiful angel after she died on Friday, December 28, 2017. Jessica Falkholt is still fighting for life in a Sydney hospital after her 21-year-old sister battled her injuries for three days before losing her fight earlier today. Writing on Facebook in a heartbreaking post, her grieving partner Jordan Brohier said he was blessed to have spent the best three years of his life with amazing Annabelle, writing, Today I lost the love of my life Annabelle. I've never met such a kind, gentle soul and this world is at such a loss without this beautiful angel. The three years I knew her were the best years of my life. I'm so thankful for every second I got to spend with my baby. I just keep hoping that I'll wake up from this terrible nightmare and see her gorgeous eyes looking back at me. She was the most amazing girl I've ever met, loved by everyone that came in contact with her. Even though I would have loved to have spent the rest of my life with her, I am happy that she is pain-free and smiling down on all those who were lucky enough to have her in their lives. The past 48 hours have been the most painful thing I've ever been through. I'm shattered without my baby and I'm dreading the pain to come of not being able to hold her in my arms, tell her I love her and hear her saying those words back to me. I love you with all my heart Boba, I'm gonna miss you so much and I'm feel so shattered that I won't be able to spend the rest of my life laughing with you, having fun with you and making you smile. From the day I met you I knew you were gonna be someone special in my life, an angel sent down to bless everyone around you. You were the best thing that has ever happened to me baby. I promise that somewhere, we will be together again, I will find you and we will live a happy long life together. I love you now and always baby, my heart will always belong to you. Jordan asked people to pray for 28-year-old Jessica, who appeared on Home and the Way in 2016, as she remains in a critical condition. He went on, I know that the Lord and her amazing parents will take care of my girl in heaven and I wish all the best to all of their family. They are all amazing people. My prayers are with darling Jess and I hope she can pull through. Please everyone, be careful when you are on the roads. You may not think it but a car is a deadly weapon if your mind isn't 100% concentrating on what you are doing. Be mindful of what you are doing when behind the wheel and constantly be aware of others around you too. When Abel Falk Holt the sisters were airlifted to hospital after they were pulled from the wreckage by other brave motorists, moments before their vehicles were engulfed in flames. Jessica is still in intensive care, surrounded by her family members. Police said the crash was caused by a car careering into their lane from the opposite side of the road. The driver of the other car, Craig Anthony Whitel, 50, was killed on impact in the tragic accident. Thanks for watching. Don't forget to like, comment your opinion, share this video and subscribe to my channel. New videos are uploaded every day.